Hey, what's up everyone? It's your friend 23 here, and welcome back to episode 10 of Tears of the Kingdom. I have been cooking off camera here some food. Now we have food for at least the next couple of episodes. And I have also made some elixirs as these two, sleep resistant, so we can backtrack to that cave sometime and climb inside of there. And also a sneaky elixir, because I uh, I had this earlier. I got this from last episode's shrine, I think. The last shrine or the, the next to the last shrine. Um, but I was thinking we're going to utilize this today to catch us a horse. Now when we have learned how to do it. Because we talked to this dude inside here last episode. But before we catch a horse, we're going to help this short dude on the side. And I also saw when I was editing last episode's video, you should press here to see the rewards. So let's... Let's see... Points and rewards. Uh, your po pony point information. You need two points to receive the th towing harness. Remember, you can also check your pon pony points card to see how many points are needed for rewards. Points and rewards. Your Pony point information. Ah, about pony points. Uh, the stable association has a point system to, re to reward members every time they use stable services. You can collect points in a variety of ways, like staying at inns or registering horses at stables. So let's stay at this inn just to get those points. So I should talk to this dude, but on this side. Welcome to the stable. Do you want to lodge with us? A regular bed costs 20 rupee. A Malania bed would be 50 rupee. What's a Malania bed? If you sleep in a Malania bed, not only will you wake up more energized. Malania, the horse god, may also share a mystical message. This makes it a very popular choice among our lodges. That sounds like a scam. Uh, but we don't offer such luxury to just anyone. Only customers with at least 7 pony points can use Malania beds. Then I can't use it. So let's take a regular bed for tonight. Just so we can get... Uh... Please note that if you do, you won't get any points. I will not use the ticket. I will save the ticket for a rainy day when I need... When I need uh, to sleep and maybe are short on cash. Uh, let's sleep until the next morning. Because we were at 9am and I don't want to miss the, the sun. So let's just reset the sun. <laughs> oh. Good morning, did you sleep well? Yeah, sure. As thanks for, the, for lodging with us, we present you with one point. Sailing, have you heard about this trouble in Sora's domain? I have not. All the good water polluted by some kind of mysterious muck. As far as I know, no one knows where it came from. It's terrible for Sora, of course, being water folks. Uh, I'm not sure how they'll manage. Sora's domain is to the east past the Lan Lanuro wetlands. I used to recommend it to tourists, but well, not anymore, I guess. So, this is that town. And they need help, so I guess we're gonna go there soon. Because we're on, on that path. We have been a lot to the east and not much to the, to the west or north. So before we do all that... We're gonna go and help this short dude to clear the, clear the, the forest of enemies. First of all... Loot an arrow and an apple. And here are some more splash fruits. That's some great arrows. This looks like something new. Yeah. Amoranth. 
This tough medicinal plant cannot be broken, but it can be cooked. Its durable yet flexible fiber raises your defense when cooked in a dish. Nice. It's always good to eat fibers. So how many enemies do we spy here? We have one up. Watching over one that chills. And if I'm not mistaken, one big one as well, yeah, because was, it was the big one he wanted away, but I'm gonna take them all away. Okay. Are you gonna alert them now by running away? I was wondering what this was. <laughs> Always getting sidetracked. This game is not good for an ADHD brain. So you always find something else that you want to check out? That's just an arrow. That's a bit sus. And then it's more arrows. Ah, if I remember, I will have to check that out as well after we have fought these guys in the forest. And I also just take a quick look here if we can see any horses, so we can know where we should go after. But I know some places where, where the horses are, so maybe we just will fast travel. <clears throat> How is the best way to approach approach this? Yes, put out a bow. And maybe a start with a bang on the big dude. I wonder if that was enough. No, he's, he's pretty much dead though. If we can just... Uh, let me sort, not by type. I wanna sort, I want that. So I just want some aimbot, so he can... <laughs> so he can be done, nice. And I guess that's everything for the quest, but, but I think we're gonna... We're gonna clear it all here, why not? That's a nice little headshot. And you as well, maybe? Ah, oh, that's bad. Ah! Oh. oh, that hit though. Boom. Now it's only one left. Let's take him with my spear. Just for the crit. We throw it away. And then we want the. Uh... A one-handed, so we can have our shield out. Ah. Nice. That's... that's enough, yeah? Ooh. Lisa Fosshorn. A thin, sharp knife-like horn. Attach it to a weapon to increase its attack power, or cook it with a critter to brew an elixir. Maybe we should attach it to, to this one. By attack power. Or do we want something else, maybe? Uh, attack power. So here, 17, 16, 13. A large curled horn with two extremely hard tips. I will probably use that one actually that we got that we just got. So let me drop it and ah, I thought I changed the fuse. Nice. That looks actually really great. This weapon. Yeah. That's a nice looking weapon. That is what I want. <laughs> Almost. Oh my god. You for real? <laughs> That's not sharp enough. 
it was worth. Oh, a tree branch we don't need. Oh, here we had a lot of things as well. I think we're gonna take Boomerang, why not? That shield is nice, but it's poor durability. I think the shields we have... Okay, this is a 3 shield, so... Just taking it is worth. Rock Boomerang. That's some scuffed... That's a scuffed weapon, let me try it. Do you... So do you th if you throw it, will it still come back? Yeah, but I forgot to cut, catch. Nice. Okay, so let me just... Okay, so it's... That one is pointing and that one is pointing. So I guess it's something in the middle here. They're pointing to this tip. Yeah. So it's good that it wasn't something I needed to run really far for. Oh, that pine cone is nice. And also, why not? Oh, those lizards are good. So I'm actually gonna try to snipe, not with this bow that has a lot of damage, that we will save for other... Ah, okay, we got one. As usual. As usually everything I have time to take before they run away. That's not worth. Oops. And I know this well will come up to the other side, so... That's why I took the weight. Oh, there it is. But I'm so slow with my reactions. That's the quest dude, right? From up. No, this is not the quest dude. This is a girl. <laughs> Water quality, fair. Moss growth, extensive. Bright caps, present. All right, that's everything. All yotted down. Oh, we have one. Up. Huh? What are you doing in a place like this? Didn't you see me, like, stand there and destroy every box here? Uh, what is it? Although. I'm in a place like this. Hey, would wouldn't happen? Hey, you wouldn't happen to be a w well enthusiast, would you? Actually, I can call myself that because I have already explored some wells. I thought so. My name is Farah. I have, I have a deep love love of, of wells too. <laughs> I don't think I have a love for wells. Uh, wells are endlessly fascinating. They're damp environment. Is that a good thing? Their unique system of life, how they stay cool when it's hot outside, that's nice. Well, enthusiasts just get it. The appeal of a good well, that's it. That is. My dream is to travel around to every single well throughout Hyrule. After scoring all the ancient text I could find on the subject, I've learned that there are 58 wells. Sadly, I haven't been able to identify their exact location. But if you have any interest in wells, then maybe you could help me. Would you tell me any well-known location? Any well locations you know ah. of? Of course. I will reward you. Of course. Hmm. How does 10 rupees per location sound? You got a deal. Ah. Really? That's fantastic. All right, then. Tell me everything. How many have I found? Is it... Ma. Five? Okay. <laughs> I have 50-something to go. <laughs> I hope I can find her later in the game. Thanks for sharing. I'm excited to go visit all these wells. Let's see. How many left across Hyrule? Oh, still a total of 53 oh. to find. You can find wells all over the place in towns and stables, of course. But even more wells, those used in the distant past, exist within ruins. <laughs> Just imagine, they were a crucial part of life all that time ago. Isn't, isn't that simply oh. fascinating? Oh, I'm going to look out landing next. There is a well there I want to see. So if you want... If you learn more well locations, meet me there. See you around. Okay, so that girl is gonna be on the landing place. Ah. Oh. I wanted that. 
I wanted that thingy. Lizard. Okay, short dude, you can breathe out. We have killed all the uh, monsters. It was you, wasn't it, Mr. Customer? You got rid of the nasty monsters. I knew it. I thought I saw you among the trees, putting in the work and getting rid of the nasty monsters. Amazing, thank you. I was so scared. I'm just a kid, so I don't have any money or anything. But I have to reward you of getting rid of that monster, so... I gave you two point pony points. Nice. Now we got the reward. Now I can welcome our customers with peace of mind. Thank you very much. You're welcome. You're welcome, dude. So let's go and redeem our reward. Hi. Hello. Ah, yes. I'll be I'll be right with you. Oh. You like to get your pony points reward, oh. right? Your reward for three points is a towing harness. Durable harness that comes as a set of horse saddle. Attach a wagon or other objects to the harness for a horse to the... Damn, so now I can build my... Finally I can build my car. <laughs> and the horse is gonna be the steering wheel. A harness is a type of horse gear that you can attach to various things. For instance, an, for instance a wagon or an item you like to tow somewhere. If you save up just one more point, the horse god fabric will be yours. That's one of a kind item you can bring to the Hateno village tie shop over in Nekluda. We appreciate your patronage. Thank you, thank you, and thank you for the reward as well. Much appreciated. Okay, I guess it's horse finding time now. And if I remember correctly, we had some horses on this field, strictly south of Lookout Landing. So, uh, let's travel there and take the sneak poise potion. And we should have a horse soon. It's the quickest way to get there is just fly in the air. Maybe a bit overkill, playing this high up. But it's great fun. Okay, so I saw horses on like this field just outside of here. Yeah, there you have them. So if we drink our sneak poison already, because it's nine minutes. So let's drink it. Then maybe we can land on a horse and then just quickly, quickly take it. I want the black one in the middle. <laughs> ah, damn. <laughs> That's a fail. Mount? Nice. Left. Sooth, sooth, sooth. Nice. We have it. We got our horse. And three in speed. I guess that's okay. Suit, it, suit, it, suit him a bit. And with that horse, we need to go to the stable. I'm gonna go to the stable with Noah, just to be sure that we're gonna find one. Good job, horsey. Yeah, thank you. Such a good horse. And maybe that stealth potion was a bit overkill. But I, di I didn't want to, to risk it. Am I even on the right way? No, 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 that's... that's very, very much wrong. Yeah, so we should be on that road over here. 
A lot of soothing needs to be done here. Oh, whoa, whoa. Yeah, you're scared about that boar. Don't have to be. Let's go again. There is some other horses. <laughs> now we're soon there. And there is the dude with that needs the help. I will come back to you soon. Hopefully. I don't remember. Uh, if I don't forget. <laughs> Same to you. It looks like you have a quest on your on your hands for me. Oh, it feels great having a horse. Like this would have taken, say maybe 10-15 minutes to walk to. Maybe not 15, but say, f say 5. 5 to 10 minutes. Ha! Look at this dude. Ha! Oh. Ha! Link, welcome to our stable. If you catch a wild horse and bring it here, you can register it. Please visit the inside counter if you want to lodge oh. with us. Now, how can I help you? I want to register a horse. Understood. Your horse will be in good hands. Bad strength. Okay, speed and stamina. Still wild. Wild temperament. So you're a... Um... Let's register it for now. 20 rupees. The first one is for free. That sounds like... Uh, Sketching. This the first one is always free. To get you hooked. Uh, oh, it looks like you've got some points saved up, Link. If you want to get your rewards, step up to the side counter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Press please enter the name of the horse. Eh, I haven't thought this through. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Let's call the horsey... Yanni. That's a great name. <laughs> Are you sure you want to name this horse Yanni? Yes, I am. Oh. Name registered. You want to take it with you or board it? I want to take my horse. Thank you. Oh. Look at this dude. Uh, that concludes the re registration process. Since you're here, would you like to equip your horse with a towing harness? Uh, not right now. Well, that's all I can do. Thank you for using the stable. Speaking of which, do you know about whistling? I do. I do. But thank you for reminding me. But your horse isn't magic. It can't hear you if you're too far away. So do keep that in mind. Come back anytime. Give me my price. Ah, yes, I'll be right with you. Like we just, just talked. And would you like to get your pony points reward, right? For five points, you get a horse god fabric. Tough fabric bearing a design of the horse god, Melania. It looks like it could be used to make a paraglider. Nice. I hear the dye shop in Hateno village has a new service using fabric. If you ever find yourself in the Cluda, you ought to stop by. I'm sure they can help you out help put this fabric to use. If you save up to just two more points, oh. you'll be able to use the Melania bed, which is said to bring prophecies from the horse god Melania. We appreciate your patronage. I appreciate you as well. Good sir. Let's mount this dude. 
Let's go, Johnny. Let's go and see if we can find uh, if it was a quest here. Stand there and let's talk. Uh, these bubble frog creatures are supposed to live in caves, eh? Nice, maybe we can get some information about these weird frogs. What's a bubble frog? What? Don't scare me. Dude, I'm standing right in front of you. <laughs> Before you even got scared. Don't scare me like that, my poor heart can take it. Why is everybody getting scared by me? Uh, uh, are you by chance looking for bubble frogs too? That's right. Ah, I knew it. They must have asked you too. Supposedly, supposedly these there are creatures called bubble frogs that live in cave, caves. They're bluish and whitish and stick to walls. Yeah, I've oh. seen them. And those two folks at Woodland Stamble in Northeast Eldin, curious pair, very strange, maybe a little off. They're looking for some something the bubble frog drop. They asked me to do the collecting. So did you ask? Did they ask oh. you to? They offered treasures in exchange. Good treasures. It was a sweet deal, at least. It would have been. But I don't know the first thing about cave creatures. A treasure was awful appealing though. And you're making me intrigued. Did you did you give me You didn't give me any side quest with that? So I should I need to remember where you said it was. Uh yeah, I have bubble games. You have the courage to not only go into the cave, but to face down a strange creature. You're a brave one, that's for sure. If you manage to get your hands on bubble gem, you should try to find those two oddballs at Woodlands, Woodland Stable in Eldin to the northeast. Northeast. Uh, those fellas were in a real frenzy to find those game gems. I bet you'll find them in the cave near the stable. I heard them talking about some rare treasures they had. I think it was like it was a mystic robe, nice, or something like that. Yeah, it might not be a bad idea idea to go and see them. So northeast, some kind of stably thingy. Probably here some somewhere. Let's just Like in one day I'm not gonna understand what I meant with that little pin, but Let's put it down for now. Ah! I want more... Eyeballs and wings. I always forget it. And when I don't forget it, they don't... Appear. <laughs> uh, okay, this is a deep cave. Here we just want to... Shoot these for some extra damage, and I guess we wanna we wanna hit the green one because he's the tanky one of them. Oh my god! Okay, we need to change weapon. But this this might be good actually if we just lure them out here. Ah. Quickly, let's eat uh, an apple. Are they burning from the? Let's boomerang this dude. <laughs> oh, they are burning from the sunlight. That's that's good to know. So let's just spear them here. Let's let them. Ah, shit! That's a lot of damage. Put a three one and a small one. You retreated. Toasty shrew. Okay, I will just try to one shot this dude. Yeah, 
Can you stand still? Nice. Wonder what it could be. And here we have some weapons. But I don't want a rusty hellbeard. Horriblin guts, rare material dropped by a horriblin. It makes bitter and un and unsuitable for cooking, but it makes an effective elixir when cooked with a critter. Good to know. But it was no blue uh, froggy here. So he lied to me, the one outside. wet walls in here we have the elixir so let's just drink it I guess but let's take the one this one and get our stamina back I thought <laughs> thought I had slip resistant on but maybe it's not taking all the slippiness away Maybe you can climb but not jump. Oh, that's not the... Uh, you can climb for longer before you fall down. But I'm not sure if this is even good. Why not just burn this thing down? I think because it's made of wood, you can do it. We should... Try, at least. You cannot. That's a bit annoying. Okay, so if I can climb up to up to this. Oh my god. Maybe literally <laughs> drop down all the way down. From one jump. So now I'm gonna fall any second here, yeah. You fall so far. How is this slip resistance? Please go. Oh, that was close. Okay, so go up one full and then fall down once. And then climb until you can jump up. That's so close, dude. Oh, you stay there. Oh, my. Oh, you don't. This is annoying. Ah, uh, dear, you have. Can you drop in from above? Is that it? This is a bit wasteful, but I'm just. There we have him. So he was here all along. Ah. Nice. At least we got that. And was that everything in that hole? Yeah. Yeah, I got 1 minute and 20 seconds to figure out how I should climb this thingy. The slippery walls. That must be the worst thing in this game. By far. By far. I'm not. I don't think I can blow this up. Let's try here. We have the last 40 seconds now. Also, I'm gonna. I won't give a damn. I'm gonna use up all my stamina for this. I will make it. I'm not gonna give up. 
So one more. Oh my god. We're soon there. I'm gonna eat all the stamina. Now we have something here. Those heals better, so let's just waste that one, I guess. And here is like, you wanna jump, but you also want some more height. Mmm, that's annoying. Wasted a lot of food <laughs> for nothing. You know what? I don't give a damn. Now we're here, now we have committed, so now let's just do this. With double slip resistance, we should be able to climb a bit more, I feel like. Otherwise, something is really off. It's better, at least. Yeah, that's annoying. This will probably be enough. We are a bit careful. Ooh, that was really close of falling down. But now we're up. Only took us half of our food. I'm actually gonna open it down below instead. And we wanna go there. I thought maybe I could uh, build a bridge or something. Let's just do this. And we're gonna fall any second now. I'm gonna probably fall once more. Yeah. Climbing simulator. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna allow it. I'm not gonna allow it. This is so not worth it. Uh, really? But... I'm so sick of this cave. <laughs> I just want to get this. God damn. Loot and... I almost fell there. Thank you. Five bomb flowers for all that food. Maybe it wasn't the most worth trade. All depends on what's what's in here. Soldier spear. Damn, that's a long spear though, so nice. But yeah, overall, I'm not sure if that was a good trade. Food wise, but who cares? We will find. I was just gonna say we're gonna we're gonna find more potions uh, ingredients for slippery things. There we have one sticky lizard. Ah, uh, mm. oh, finally done. That's some nice loot. Actually, thank you for that. Was it the damage? Yeah, so okay, so it drops more the more damage you apply on it. Good to know. And there we have a well as well. Ah, ha, ha. Good horsey, good horsey. Yeah, you can... Whee! Ah, nice. We have a small side quest here. Oh my gosh, already. I waited a long time for someone to rescue me. It's my own darn fault I'm here, though. Dropped something down the well and climbed in after it. I even had a ladder, but yeah, it broke when I tried to climb up. Ah. 
Then on top of that, my best buddy I go everywhere with should have noticed, but uh, he didn't. He kept right on going. So so you were two guys when you were going up here, uh, down and then up, but he has left you. Come on, man, really? Sorry, not your fault. Can't tell you how happy I am that you came down here. But what now? The ladder is wrecked. I mean, the broken part is still here, so we technically could fix it if the dang ladder wasn't too high to reach. Dude, I got some uh, magic powers that you never have seen. Why? Select a challenge from the adventure log will mark the game. Boom. Can we get two? No. Always one. Did I even... Where is my loot? Just straight up disappeared. That's weird. Oh, dude, I can fix your ladder. Ah, oh, we have some more there. So let me. I know it's it's the other one I should probably use, but I just want to see what happens if we rewind. Oh, nothing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do the, the other one. Not this one. That one. That one, correct. Oh, that's a slippery ladder. I didn't think it was that slippery. slippery. So I need to grab it from an end. Like that, and boom, and attach. That should be enough. Do we talk now? It's just you and me now stuck down at the bottom of a well. Not the worst place to call home, I guess. Dude, are you blind? Huh? Wait, it's fixed. Did you do that? You're incredible. Now let's get out of here. Now let's get out of here. Man, you saved me. I thought I'd be stuck in that well for the rest of my life, seriously. I really owe you, so here, take this. 50 rupees. I'm going to catch up on my buddy Jora and head for the foothill stable so we can apply for Sonia's server team. See you around, thanks again, and hey, don't go falling into any wells. Well, I have a quest that literally wants me to fall into wells, so I'm probably gonna do it a couple of times more this game. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Let's help this dude now. You're a good horsey. Boom. That's a balloon. Where are you going, dude? Don't run away from me. You don't have to be afraid. So is it... Is this really it? Let's try. I don't think this will be enough, but why not try? Ah, it was enough. Nice. Ah, it was not enough. Damn. Okay. That and one more, basically. Or even maybe we should take another... We should take a more flat piece. Because those can go straight through, maybe. Is the horse going again? No. I'm just starting to hear things. And then just attach this like that. That is so straight it can be. <laughs> Ah! 
We don't need to read this because we have read it a lot of times already here. Perfect. It was indeed. With your help, President Hudson is now standing proudly and firm in place. It fills my heart with joy to see him doing so well on his own. Take this with my thanks. <laughs> also, you must be hungry after all that hard work. Let's give me some food and then give me something special. Another sleepover oh. ticket. Bye bye. <laughs> And then just bring this back. Come here, horsey. Going out on some adventures. I really need to find myself a better horse soon here. Okay. Let's think for a minute. So either we go and start the main quest over here or we should go... I think we should go here first because my guess is this is the forest. The... Lost Forest, or what it's called, and then we can trade in our Croco Seeds for some more weapon slots. I really feel that that's, that's something we need really soon. Oh. Damn. Mm, here you are also. Turns out Bullf Bubble Frog can be found in every cave, so I'm thinking I might check out another cave. Though that... Though I don't doubt it will be, I will be able to find one that isn't dark and scary. Dude, if you're so scared, maybe you shouldn't. I know where to find them. Bye bye. Okay, so we go over the bridge and then to the left, and also just mark that one as a side mission on the way so we can unlock the map. mad now. This horse got way too much temper for me. There you go. Are you scared of the thunder? Long travel. And we're not gonna fight them, we're just gonna keep on running. We have better shit to do. Well, there is also probably the thing that he talked about earlier. Do that. And. Edit shrine, then maybe we can take away this one. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm not gonna be sure what that means. Oh, delete the blue pin, and we don't even need to. to ah! I jumped off it.
Oh, here is someone who needs help. Then let me help you. I hit him. And he, that's scuffed. Can you aggro me instead? Thank you. Ah. Thought that was a good dodge, but it wasn't. Can you help me now? You have a perfect hitting... Again? I guess I have to jump to the side on those. Nice. There we go. That was way too hard than it should have been. Yeah. Thank you, the thanks. Things were looking a little dicey, but you pulled me out of the fire. As a chef, there's no better way to thanks than with food. Deep fried drumstick. Oh. Sounds delicious. Uh, my name is Sa Savre. I'm a traveling chef, constantly on the lookout for the freshest ingredients that caves can offer. If you need to do some cooking yourself, you're welcome to use my pot. I'm not sure how else to repay ah. you. Wait, maybe I do. I can share all that I've learned while going through the caves. Caves are full of valuable ingredients and ores. Think of them as Hyrule's natural treasure chests. Trust me, knowing your caves can be a major boon for travelers. Mm. For instance, ah, there is an opening in the ground north of here that leads into a cave. If you break one of the ore deposits in there with a hammer, you can get ore, obviously, but more than that. There's flint for starting fires, rock salt for seasoning, cooking, and luminous stones and gems to sell for high ah. prices. Oh. Yeah, I know all this. Thank you for the information, though. <laughs> But I guess if you embark on the main quest early, you that's some good early knowledge, dude. This horse. You make me mad sometimes. Who do we have here? That's a good looking old man. Uh, hmm, ah, Link. I'd heard. Uh, this is Kado, by the way. I heard that you and Princess Zelda had gone missing. I'm thrilled to see you alive and well. But where is Princess Zelda? What? The Princess Zelda is still missing? Well then, Link. You may want to meet with Lady Impa. She's investigating the geoglyphs that have appeared across the land. Yeah, that's the big, like. Uh, Call it letters on the ground that we, we have seen when we have flown up in there. Um, that have appeared across the land. A curious name for this strange phenomena. Lady Impa believes that they are crucial in the search for Princess oh. Selva. She's traveling in one of those new balloon contraptions and should be at New Serene Stable right now. Is it that stable over there? I'm in a hurry to meet Lady Impa, but I can't go anywhere nearly as fast as she can in a balloon. Let's see. New Serene Stable is just a little to the no northwest of Central Hyrule. If you excuse me, I need to be on my way. Okay, so that's not the... Uh... Did we get that as a quest also? Nice. That's a main quest. Okay. But I'm gonna chill with that, because now we have a lot of things planned already. And who is this dude? Or girl, rather? What is... What if the hem... What is your outfit? <laughs> is it mushrooms? <laughs> Looks like... Uh, yeah. I, I think you all see what it can huh? look like. Uh, what did you say also? Uh -huh. I overheard some great info on Misko's treasure and it looks like you overheard me. Perfect. This is so juicy I gotta share. You heard of Misko's treasure? The famous bandit's huge clothing collection? The story goes that Misko hid in the caves all throughout the land. Just the thought of getting my fashion loving heart pounding. Oh. They say the caves of Eldin are practically bursting with treasures, uh, which would be exciting if they weren't also bursting with lava. 
if I walked into one dressed like this, my cloth would be burned to the crisp. Was that everything? Aww. Yep. Okay, so... Something, something... <laughs> caves somewhere burning lava. Is it up here? Maybe the caves are burning lava. Oh, is that the one... It is. And also we don't wanna... We want to sometime soon. <laughs> but it's more important to look up this one for the forest, actually. So let's just start at the stable. Welcome, you found your way to the Woodland stamble, Stable. Thank you for supporting the Stable Association. Since this is your first time here, we'll add one point to your pony points. Now we need one more point for the reward. Now then, once again. Oh. Welcome, Link. Do you want to register a horse or take one out for a ride? How can I help? I don't want to do anything. I just wanted to say hi. Uh, we are the closest able to Goron City, home of the Gorons, of course. Death Mountain is done erupting, and the Syrian roads are in good condition. <laughs> Though you still find hot lava inside the caves, so take care of not getting burned. Blue I'm searching for those who wanted my thingy. These two look strange. Should we tell the newspaper what happened here? Absolutely. We tell the whole awful story to the lucky Clover Gazette and no one else. They take it seriously. A dude looks <laughs> a nose and mustache. I don't know how we'll get word of this to them though. The Lucky Clover Gazette is in the Hebra region. They're working out of stable, I heard. That's all so far west though. They weren't the dudes I wanted. I hope they are, are all alright. Uh, oh, do my eyes deceive me or do you plan on setting out? I take if you're also headed to Goron City, this may be an odd warning, but do you try to watch out for Gorons with strange rocks? <laughs> We're not gonna go to Goron City quite yet. I wanna find the person who wants my... Why is everybody so weirdly clothed here? Ah, this is quite the outfit you put together. Talk for yourself. Uh, although, perhaps it could be a little more um, coordinated. That is, a complete set would really work for you. Sorry, my eye for fashion can't help but see what it sees. I'm forever tempted by the latest styles, and the same is true for my <clears throat> boyfriend. The two of us were going to Goron City to buy their trendy fire resistant clothes. When we were about to arrive, we got tangled up with some gorons with strange looking rocks. I got scared and came back on my own. If you're going to Goron City, then you should be very careful. I understand that much. Oh, is this your first time here, mister? Welcome to the woodland stable. Hey, I gotta know. Are you looking for f stuff that fell from the sky too? 
Oh, dude, I remember where... Uh, where those uh, people were that wanted the, the shiny things from the frogs. That's the thing I'm searching for. He said a cave nearby, right? And a cave north, east or west from the... From the stable, so it's probably in the water there. But I'm gonna go up to this shrine just to, so we have a quick, tra quick travel point. Let's do this shrine first. <laughs> Rise and fall. Ekushiyu shrine. So that will probably... Yeah. And then we just use... Oh! <laughs> I didn't really think that through. And now I'm stuck. Give me some food. And yes, do that again, I guess. Then stop. That was not correct. to let it fall back and now we can so obvious okay okay here I must like think on how I place it can I climb it yeah That one because it has bad durability and then we can just chill on this for a while Just first of all, try what's happening here. Yes. I, I see what we should do. Put this dude here. Make it jump and land, and then rewind it. of those lights so we should <laughs> actually go back to a praying station but that will be that's that will probably 
The upgrade of life will probably be for next episode, because this is everything we had time for today. If you have enjoyed this episode, please consider liking and leave a comment. This has been 23. I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.